Aerial marker balls, also known as visibility marker balls or simply marker balls, are colorful balls that are placed on high voltage power lines. They are used to enhance the visibility of power lines and other aerial obstructions to prevent accidents involving low flying aircraft. Aerial marker balls or visibility spheres are small balls of bright color, often orange or red, used to increase visibility of power lines from the air. These balls are typically attached to power transmission lines using lightweight cables or other mechanisms. Aerial marker balls help to reduce the risk of collision of aircraft, birds, and other flying objects with the power lines, which enhances the safety of the all parties involved, and at the same time helps to ensure the reliability of the power grid. Applications Aerial marker balls help save lives and protect expensive infrastructure by making power lines and guy wires more visible to low-flying planes and helicopters. Marker balls are typically used in airport and heliport approach areas and where power lines span long distances crossing canyons, lakes, and rivers. Purpose The primary purpose of these marker balls is safety. They are used to make power lines and other aerial obstructions visible to pilots, especially those flying at low altitudes. This is particularly important in areas where aircraft tend to fly low, such as near rivers, mountain passes, deep valleys, highways, and runways. Design Aerial marker balls are usually brightly colored, with the most commonly used color being International Danger Orange. However, other colors such as yellow, red, and white may also be used depending on the surroundings for clear visibility. They typically weigh around 7.7 .7 kilograms 17 pounds. Installation. Installation Installing these marker balls on power lines can be a challenge due to the height and location of the lines. However, they are often installed by helicopter on hot lines. Examples you might have noticed these marker balls while driving down a highway, where they are often installed on power lines crossing the road. They are also commonly used in areas with deep valleys or gorges, where power lines might be difficult to spot. Aerial marker balls play a crucial role in aviation safety by making power lines and other potential aerial hazards more visible to pilots. They are a simple yet effective solution to a potentially dangerous problem. Installation process. The installation of aerial marker balls on power lines is a complex process that traditionally involves technicians either using a helicopter or ropes. The sphere is positioned on the cable by climbing the structure, and the team on the ground maneuvers the ball to the installation location using ropes. The sphere is then closed using a mechanism on the ball. However, Recent advancements have led to the development of drone robots that can semi-automatically install these marker balls. This method is not only more cost-effective, but also significantly safer for the technicians involved. Manufacturing Aerial marker balls are typically made of lightweight, lightweight, durable materials such as plastic or fiberglass. This allows them to withstand various weather conditions and remain visible for extended periods. They are often installed in areas where traditional marker systems, such as lights or flags, are not practical or cost-effective. Regulations According to the Federal Aviation Administration FAA guidelines, aerial marker balls should mark all power lines 200 feet or higher, or those posing a potential safety hazard for low-flying aircraft. The diameter of the markers used on extensive catenary wires catenary wires that cross canyons, lakes, rivers, etc. should not be less than 36 inches 91 centimeters. Four power lines below 50 feet and within 1,500 feet of an airport runway end, smaller 20-inch 51 centimeter spheres are permitted. Each marker should be a solid color, specifically aviation orange, white, or yellow. Aerial marker balls are a crucial safety measure in the aviation industry. They are meticulously designed, manufactured, and installed to ensure maximum visibility of power lines and other aerial obstructions, thereby preventing accidents involving low-flying aircraft. While aerial marker balls are crucial for aviation safety, they do come with a few disadvantages. 
Installation Challenges The installation of these marker balls on power lines can be a complex and dangerous process. It often involves technicians either using a helicopter or ropes. Recent advancements have led to the development of drone robots that can semi-automatically install these marker balls, but these technologies are not yet widely adopted. Maintenance Over time, these marker balls may fade, get damaged, or become less visible due to weather conditions or bird strikes. This requires regular inspection and maintenance, which can be costly and time-consuming. Wire sag The addition of marker balls adds weight to the power lines, which can increase wire sag or droop. This is particularly a concern for power lines that are already under significant tension. Limited, limited effectiveness. While these marker balls enhance the visibility of power lines, they may not be entirely effective in poor visibility conditions such as fog, heavy rain, or at night. Aesthetic impact. Some people might find these brightly colored balls visually unappealing, especially in areas of natural beauty. Despite these disadvantages, the use of aerial marker balls is still a widely accepted and effective method for enhancing the visibility of power lines and other aerial obstructions, thereby preventing accidents involving low-flying aircraft. Maintenance and Inspection Marker balls require regular inspection and maintenance to ensure they remain effective. Over time, these balls may fade, get damaged, or become less visible due to weather conditions or bird strikes. This requires regular inspection and maintenance, which can be costly and time-consuming. For maintenance personnel, marker balls provide a visual reference point for locating specific transmission line portions. This can be especially helpful when conducting routine inspections, repairs, or upgrades. Wire sag. The addition of marker balls adds weight to the power lines, which can increase wire sag or droop. This is particularly a concern for power lines that are already under significant tension. Wire sag or droop will occur due to temperature, wire weight, wind, etc. 25-25 feet 7.62 m is the maximum allowable distance between the highest wire installed with marker balls and the highest wire without marker balls and shall not violate the SAG requirements of the transmission line design. Limited Effectiveness While these marker balls enhance the visibility of power lines, they may not be entirely effective in poor visibility conditions such as fog, heavy rain, or at night. Pilots can more easily avoid flying into or near the transmission lines when they are marked with bright, obvious balls. balls. However, the human eye starts to lose its visual acuity at just a few degrees off dead center. Other reasons for pilots being unable to notice the power lines are light conditions and dirty windscreens, etc. Aesthetic Impact Some people might find these brightly colored balls visually unappealing, especially in areas of natural beauty. They're strung across electric wires all over the country. But just what are the balls on power lines for? We solve the mystery. There's something about driving that sets the mind wandering. Considering your dinner plans, counting down the days to your next vacation, or contemplating some interesting facts. Despite these disadvantages, the use of aerial marker balls is still a widely accepted and effective method for enhancing the visibility of power lines and other aerial obstructions, thereby preventing accidents involving low flying aircraft. Aerial marker balls, while crucial for aviation safety, do have some environmental considerations. Material Usage Marker balls are typically made of durable, lightweight materials like plastic or fiberglass. The production of these materials can have environmental impacts, including the use of non-renewable resources and the generation of greenhouse gases. Waste Generation Over time, Marker balls may need to be replaced due to damage or fading. This can lead to waste generation. However, many companies are now looking at recycling programs or using materials that are more environmentally friendly. Visual Impact Some people might find these brightly colored balls visually unappealing, especially in areas of natural beauty. 
This visual pollution can have an impact on the enjoyment of natural landscapes. Wildlife interactions. There's potential for interactions with wildlife. Birds, for example, might collide with the marker balls or power lines. However, it's worth noting that the marker balls actually aim to reduce such incidents by making the power lines more visible. Energy consumption. The process of installing and maintaining these marker balls requires energy, which has its own environmental impact. This includes the fuel used by helicopters or drones used in the installation process. In summary, while aerial marker balls do have some environmental impact, their role in preventing accidents and enhancing safety for low-flying aircraft is significant. It's also worth noting that manufacturers and industry regulators are continually looking for ways to minimize these environmental impacts. Aerial marker balls are essential for power transmission lines since they improve visibility, enhance safety, and ensure reliability. These balls provide an effective and cost-effective solution for power companies to address various safety concerns related to power transmission lines, including complying with regulations and reducing the risk of damage to these lines. The use of aerial marker balls is a proactive strategy that power companies can employ to ensure that the power grid operates optimally and efficiently, without fear of unnecessary interruptions or accidents.